not you. Why not us tonight? Yeah, you got to right. earn the next yeah, ball game right. and keep earning them and keep earning them. Is today your last ball game? It absolutely is not your last ball game. You've earned seven of them in your career. The rest of you guys have earned multiple games. Keep on winning, keep on winning. It's a little bit different than what else the other people in the Valley are doing. When they go out and they go out, why not you? Make sure that you don't get long and you're kind of falling asleep a little bit. If you are the other team and you've been told by everybody across the state of Texas on how bad you were going to get this on this out on the fight. Think about that. That's what we're up against. Okay? Do not disrespect this team we're playing. Hey folks, Mr. Bowtie here. Keep banging home that red subscribe button on your screen so that way you can stay up to date on all the great local sports coverage that TV and radio refuse to cover. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter at Mr. Bowtie1982. It's fun, it's free, and it's safe for the environment. Thank you so much and enjoy the show. The third round of the Austin Westlake Invitational, more commonly known as the 6A Division II playoffs, taking place at the Alamo Dome as the host Chaparral's taking on upset minded PSJA North. PSJA North comes in with a record of 10 and 2 coming up from the Valley, but they have not faced anybody probably even 10% as strong as what Austin Westlake is, ranked number three nationally. They haven't lost a game this decade. Of course, they're led by Kate Klubnick going to Clemson and a slew of Division One prospects. But the beautiful part about the playoffs is you don't know what's going to happen.
Raiders' upset bid did not materialize. Kate Klubnik threw five first half touchdowns, did not play at all in the second half. The Shaps with another easy win, 56-0 over the Raiders as they move on to the fourth round. We saw a lot of good stuff that we knew we could attack and some vulnerability in their DBs, and uh, but also a light box where we could let Kaiser go and run it. It was great to go out there and just uh, strike early. Um, super proud of my teammates, super proud of my quarterback for delivering great balls to me and, uh, and all my other teammates just going out there and helping each other out. Preparation throughout the week, you know, just uh, just taking it one day at a time, just respecting our opponent and um, knowing, what, knowing that they're wanting to come beat us at the same time. Next up in the Westlake Invitational will be a former district mate, Austin Vandergrift, in the state quarterfinals at DKR Stadium in Austin. Reporting from the Alamo Dome in San Antonio, I'm Mr. Bowtie.